This video is titled Playland Classic Photos Part 3 and this video was taken on this Thursday evening June 14th for 2012 and the time right now is 10.20 p.m. Alright we're going to scroll down as you can recall we had used this before Playland Then and Now a photo documentary well you're going to see four right here That's from uh, the Grand Carousel, one of the horses. Look at this photo. Let's discuss this for a moment. All right, I don't know when this was taken, but it's an old one. See, I have a really good Sony camera, eight pixels. So what I do is I take pictures of these on a Google search, and then I zoom in and make them larger. Very good with the trick photography. I have my own secrets. You see all this land over here? So obviously, Playland was built in 1928. We could guess that this property here wasn't developed yet. Okay, uh, there could be houses there. I can't zoom in anymore. Anyway, that's the parking lot. Looks like a full day there today. Okay, so now you have the airplane coaster over there and the dragon coaster. So this was built years ago. I think they had taken down the airplane coast in 1957. I think it was dangerous with the turns. I don't know if any cars uh, derailed and went, went off. I don't think so. But I think it was dangerous. This is all kitty land today. Yep. Nice photo. Now, when we call Playland Rye Playland, I would love to make all of Rye Playland. Imagine if all that property was Playland. Or let's say from this point over here, encompassing the parking lot, and let's say this here was the parking lot. Oh man, Playland would be at least two and a half to three times larger. It would be really fantastic if they ever could do that, but no, they won't do that. Because it costs money. Okay, here's a better view. Okay, I guess that's the Dragon Coaster toward the end of the parking lot. I'm almost sure of it. Here's a more modern photo. This one's color. Yep, again with my cleverness and my trick photography, I was able to log this up on Google, take a photo of it. Yep, and then I zoom in on it. I attach them to my uh, Microsoft Word. And that's how I make, uh, how I scroll down. And there's the Dragon Coaster over there. This is a good shot. Picnic Groves. In my mind, they should be eliminated. Split this property in half. You could put the Fun House over here. And, no, okay, my mistake. <laughs> that's the Auto Scooter. Which is really the bumper cars. All right. Here's the property. You divide it right down. You split it right down the middle. Fun House goes there. Magic carpet goes there. And any architects that work for Playland are saying to themselves, keep dreaming, pal. You know, all right, you don't want to listen to me. You're going to draw crowds. Do not want to listen. And this ice casino, in my mind, it's got to go. It should be converted into some exhibit ride, like a, a drive through ride, like the Indiana Jones ride at uh, Disneyland. Nope, again. Playland thinks small. Each year you go back to Playland. Hi, welcome to Playland. But there's no changes. Uh, we even have a new law now that uh, we don't like the idea of cameras. So please eliminate your camera and go back with some memories that you didn't capture on camera. Doesn't that sound really cool or in and intelligent? No, it doesn't. <laughs> Just kidding around. This is a really old photo. Look at this one. I believe this is when Playland was built. Yeah. I'm pretty good at uh, locating all these photos. Uh, let's see. What angle would this be? Could that be the front entrance? It looks like it. It looks like these two gentlemen are working. Look how desolate it is. Look at that. That would make sense that that's the airplane coaster because this looks like uh, the front entrance. Over here, what do they call it? The colonnades? It used to be like a, a fast food chain restaurant, sort of like uh, the way Burger King is there today, something of that nature. 
And then we go down to our last photo. Look at this. Playland pool, no doubt somewhere in the 50s or early 60s. You know how I could tell? By the style of the bathing suits. Yep, old fashioned. Sorry about these riffles in here. That's the way that it came out when I had taken the photo. But you know, it's pretty interesting because it almost looks like a seashell. Look at the way the ripples turn up. Isn't that something? I swear I didn't plan it that way. Nope, not at all. All right, so that completes our four photos. Another classic slideshow at Rye Playland.